Let me know when we're, our mics are up. There we go. It's your girl, Mickey, 360 Radio. Before I even shout out the sponsors, I have to say this because it was hilarious. He was like, when I offered him some edibles before the show, my guy Connor here, he's like, nope, I don't do that. I'm straight and laced. You know, I'm not. I'm a square. Yeah. And I turned to him when that song came on, and I was like, you don't sound like a square. And he was like, that wasn't me. That wasn't me. That was Germ yeah. Deezy. So I'm not dropping M-bombs. Like no. <laughs> Shout out Germ Deezy and Miranda Cosgrove. Yeah, that's my girl. What was what was the show again? Uh, I Carly. I Carly. I Carly. So you know, a little out of my age range, yeah, but I, don't, I ain't never watched I Carly, but I heard about it though. You should check it out. They just uh, did a reboot. Okay, I'm gonna think about <laughs> it. <laughs> Connor, let me shout out these sponsors real quick. Uh, Boss Lady Products, Go Dare Magazine, um, uh, Made It. Mina made it. Mina made it. Made me a whole ass date rape drink. So all y'all out there, if you see the green one, don't don't drink it or pay double. Just the crack. Cougar. Just the <laughs> it crack depends cougar right what here. you're looking to get done. Um, shout out to Nails by Cree. If you ever need custom press on nails, you don't want to go sit down with somebody for two hours and fucking smell their hot ass breath and have them ask her questions. You can just ha- hit her up. She'll get sizes from you and she'll send you the press ons that you want. Because I don't function daily with these on. You know, I'm only fabulous a few times a week. Uh, so yeah, I'm a hip hop producer from uh, Sacramento, California. Um, been making beats for like six years now, just turned 22. Um, came on here today. I got this dope project um, with a lot of local uh, talented artists. Um, I did all the production, kind of put everybody together. It was like, hey, I think you'd be good on this, you'd be good on that, yada, yada. And then fucking just put it together. And it's kind of like a, a, the blueprint for kind of like more unity, more community based shit in Sacramento. Because yeah, we don't have say. that. Like, this is. It's weird because if you were from, like, New York, South, like, this isn't really a, a new idea to have a hip-hop producer have an album. But in Sacramento, it's like, what the fuck are you doing? Right. Yeah. You can't have certain people with certain yeah, people. Yeah. So and, when you yeah. have everybody from different sides of the city on the same project, I think that's I think that's lit. And, yeah. That's dope. It yeah. is dope. You get everybody from the, all the sides of the city on one project, that's, that's dope. And it's an accomplishment because it's a peaceful way of, of bringing people together and letting people hear the music, you know. Exactly. And these are beats that you have made yeah, or so procured? I, or I produced all these beats, and then I mixed and mastered everything myself. All right, what? What, pro- what, what programs do you use? Uh, I use Studio One to record. Okay. And I mix and master in that. Yes, sir. And what you what you use to make your beats on? Uh, I make my beats. So I got like a shitty Asus laptop, but I use FL. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's why I am. Yeah. So I be using Logic and all that, too, so yeah, I understand yeah. how, what, what it is yeah. or what it takes. To get there, we'll yes. keep going, man. So that track, uh, Miranda Cosgrove, mm-hmm. we kind of discussed the background on it, um, which was uh, iCarly. Yep. But uh, is there anything else behind the track that you wanted to bring up, or? Um, I mean, just shout out to Germ. I feel like he's one of the most consistent, underrated. Uh, Absolutely, out of Sacramento um, for sure. Yeah. Um, I hear him on almost everyone's projects because he's another artist that's not for afraid to get jump on other sides of the fence. Exactly, he, which yeah. is pretty cool to me, because mm. I interview lots of artists and there's a lot of artists that won't double line like that. And it's like exactly. this is a, a business, and if you want to make money in a business, then you have to be ready uh, to adapt. Yeah, you got to adapt. Gotta, you got to function with everybody, uh, even if it's just professionally. You know, so I uh, salute you for that, and I take my hat off. I will in a minute. I don't want to mess up my hair. <laughs> right now but i'll take my hat off to you (laughs) for that but if you want to go rob a bank later we can do that too because i have my my um i have my um Okay, what's up, Mickey? You, you, I see you. They you got the glasses there. on. She got the crystal glasses going crazy tonight. Y'all, I wish y'all could see them glasses. You, they you can let see them. The, oh, you can't can. Them yeah. glasses going. <laughs> I need me a pair. Ham sandwich. But wait till you, I change these. These are going to be ham and cheese sandwich. I'm wet, though. I ain't going to lie. I need me a pair of them. Yeah, they are. They are. This, this just I ain't got a pair happens to match the pink shirt. This is the caked up shirt. This is Stockton. This is Seuss out of uh, Stockton, California. Where your money at, Dom P? Glasses caked up. I need um, me a pair. They have definitely all colors for purchase right now. And it says caked up on the side on the hip. Some guy had the nerve to ask me if I was going to get a BBL when I get my big bag. Yeah. That's how they feel. What? Yeah, you get a BBL when you get your big bag. Yeah. That's well, I, the first part was I like the idea that he said when I get my big yeah, bag. Like you're not there. It's yeah. well, it's gonna happen then. You mean it's gonna happen when I get it? Because it's 
I don't I don't have the largest bag yet, but it's pretty big. I'm pretty, but you don't want to get a BBL though because they ain't got no seats left on the airport. I know, I've been watching that. That's what I'm saying. So when you go stand up though, why do I feel like the oh, dude's right, guys? So I feel like I got locked you. out. Um, it's no, crazy. I was like, are we looking at the same posterior backside? As, are we looking at the same bitch? Because I don't need a BBL. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I am from Texas. Like okay. I grew up on pound cake and greens. Like I don't. It's natural. It's already there. No matter how small I get as a person, no matter how much weight yeah. I lose, the ass will still be there. I don't need it. But thank you for. I see. I ain't gonna lie. I have seen you be putting a little, them little thirst trap pictures the last couple of days up there too. I ain't gonna see you. I, I need some new lie. fucking. Uh, you meat. think she's slick? You been up there? She be having her little. You, you ain't slick. You out there fishing? She, you, you, you If you I see it, then you know, everyone sees man, it. Man, I was like, look at my partner. My partner out line fishing. She got her pole in the water right now. Well, that's because a couple of my fish are starting to get a little squ- uh, squiggly. They're getting a little. Uh, they, they're getting a little, uh, what's that word? Uh, slippery. They're getting a little, oh, they're, they're man, trying to slip, or slip right you. out of the fucking net. No, no, <laughs> bruh. Crocs don't keep fish in the net. We got the Crocs, baby. We got the Croc Cougar yeast. And now you got the drink. You can you leave really... with the Crocs right now. I don't care. I got plenty <laughs> more. But take only the Crocs and leave the gibbets. I ain't gonna lie. Speaking of Crocs, I ordered some wrong ones. I'm hella mad. See, because you didn't have me order them. You didn't I have ordered me some order. Amazon and they go send me some without the Croc From logo. From China. Yep. I don't even know what that is. And though. it was a smaller size than you wear. Hella right? mad. I got it there. I thought I was gonna have a Croc. It had a big ass A on the side. What is so that? So let me. I'm gonna clue Avenger? y'all in on this because these guys real. may they may not know our story, our okay, background. My bad. I'm sorry, dude. But he's. This is the when when Tapping came on as a co-host. I had made mention that. I have put Crocs on plenty of men because all my t- men, the men that I fuck with, I buy them Crocs when they wear, they're at, they're at my house. They have Crocs for my house. And I customize them with little gibbets. Like I put little names and, you know, the little pictures and shit on them. And uh, so ever since then, he's been harassing me. And now his sister made me a drink called the Croc Cougar, which is like a cocktail. So now I'm date raping people to get them into the Crocs. And now I sent the wrong guy the wrong gibbets for the Crocs. So somebody else's name is being spelled on his shoes and he's not happy. So, yeah, I'm putting up thirst traps because I'm about to lose one. I see. Okay. okay. It makes sense now. No, I'm about I, to lose I see one. why you putting that shit on Thanks display. Thanks to the Crocs. Line. Fuck you guys. <laughs> Don't ship them anywhere else but my house anymore. She out ever. there putting that shit on display. You, you are not slick. I'm not. That's why I got caught. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Connor. Yeah. What is the future for Connor Helms? Uh, and what is the hippie life movement? Uh, the future is wherever the universe takes me. I'm not really a... I don't have a, you know... You're not a planner. I am not a planner. To, to an extent, but obviously plans don't go... As, as planned. Plans, yeah. Right. So you just got to know, have faith in yourself, have faith in the vision, and just keep going. Yes. Um, Trust but, the process. Yeah, and that's pretty much the same shit for hippie life, you know. Um, you know, that's my family, my day ones. Really got me into this shit. You so, see you got your boys in the building. Yeah. Shout out to them in here. Deuce Bigelow. Okay, Deuce Jorin, Bigelow. Join. We got my man G. Cruiser, my man Maggiano. Right okay. There. Yep. Shout out to the squad, man. That's Hey, that's support, man. Yeah. You know how hard it is to... For your friends to do Facts. the simplest things, Not really. that's big, man. I, I salute y'all for up. being here, man. I yeah. salute y'all for support, man. That's big. Just to show up. Well, yeah, and hippie life is, uh, I kind of like the approach because it's peaceful. You know, it's not like a, you ain't hella banging on people. Like, you know, what is what the fuck are hippie? How is a hippie going to hurt you? <laughs> Overstone you to death with weed? Like, you yeah. want to smoke some more weed, man? You're like, hippies are fucking peaceful yeah, people. Hit you in the head with a skateboard. You better be, be respect these hippies. <laughs> is that what hippie life for? represents to hey, y'all? Man. Like, peace, love, unity, yeah. music? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it should. You know, I just went to Kushstock, and that reminded me of hippie life because Kushstock was like um, Woodstock, but for weed. Fucking 120,000 degrees outside. Trust me. I still have, like, third-degree burns on my Caucasian white alabaster skin. Uh, I know. know. It's fucking really not good at all. Alabaster. Alabaster. That's 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 my word. (laughs) Alabaster. What's your skin type? I'm alabaster. Alabaster white. That's right. Porcelain toilet white. Damn. Um, just kidding. Uh, <laughs> it's that drink, Mina. That's Assholes. Drink. <laughs> What's the drink, Mina? <laughs> it's that drink. You shouldn't have gave me that drink. So let's go into your next song, yep. Losing Focus, because that's what I'm doing right yep. now. This is by uh, Maggiano over there. Okay. The yep. 
And this, this, this is, is probably his my, song? Uh, yeah, it's my, one of my favorite songs on the project. And you yeah. did production on yep. this song. Produces too, yep. Got it. Losing Focus, y'all. Imagine Losing Focus, him, right here. Home. DJ Eddie Z in the building, y'all. Peter Parker. I see a lot of people on the live. What's up? Wow. Mm. I think I'm dope as fuck. I think I'm fucking lit. Just rolled another blunt cause me and sober never mix. You used to hold me up and now you don't exist. Sometimes I throw you up. Like ho, you make me sick At night I think about my life Feel like it don't mean shit Different mistakes was made When we was only kids I was trying to get paid Made more than I spent Spent more than I made Started over again Couldn't call it a phase It was more than a trend I'm done dropping dough on the chain I might as well blow it on rent I got something to say Yo, I wrote this shit to vent I think I'm way too high, I think I'm losing focus I wait till I'm alone to cry so can't nobody notice Woke up said fuck the world, but I ain't got a chosen Don't think that I ain't come outside, bro, niggas hide from no bro Woke up said fuck the world, but I ain't got a chosen Don't think that I ain't come outside, bro, niggas hide from no one I think I'm way too high I think I'm fucking lit. Police stop harass us and blast us. Ain't that a fucking bitch? To the coons and crackers, tell Massa Maggie said, suck a dick. I'm getting way too high, and I'm starting to like it. Can't trust the whites, these niggas lied about coronavirus. The media promoting violence, police starting riot. They black our eyes and take our lives and think we gon' stay silent. I think I'm way too high, I think I'm fucking lit. Just wrote another blunt, cause me and sober never mix. You used to hold me up, and now you don't exist. Sometimes I throw you up, like ho, you make me sick. At night I think about my life, feel like I don't mean shit. Different mistakes was made when we was only kids. I was trying to get paid, make more than I spent, spent more than I made, started over again. It's a good thing, you know, but it's like in the house all day. That's the kind of stuff you sit around, you smoke to mm-hmm. reflect, yep. uh, you know, take some time off for yourself. Yep. I like it. I like it a lot. And we'll make sure to continue to play yep, it. Thank um, you. Any live shows, performances, uh, album uh, drops? What are you promoting right now? Funny you say that. Well, all these songs are on a project called The Times Are Changing. Um, so I produce the whole thing, mix and master the whole thing. Um, it's got 14 22 tracks. years old you guys and then I'm Just also take note throwing a show uh, on Saturday uh, at the studio we got in Citrus Heights City Sound good uh, community center for up and coming artists um, but anyways shows on the 17th uh, from 8 to 11 um, it's r- some real just like community shit I'm putting the artists in a position to win I'm trying just to break even fucking uh, yeah good some good 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 yeah. so that's this weekend yeah so we'll definitely uh, make sure to get the word out about that. There we my, go. My bad, my bad. Eddie's like trying to tell as quiet as possible. You you can <laughs> yeah, just say I, it. I'm talking, I don't want to do it. Why the video won't talk? Well, we'll definitely put the word out on that. So send me yeah, all the information in my DMs so we can you. continue to uh, pump the pr- like the pro- the promo on that thank, thank event. Um, and music can is it available at all like digital uh, platforms? So this comes out on the 16th. So it comes out next Friday. Okay, cool. This Friday, I guess. Yeah. Next Friday. So yeah. these are exclusives right now. Yeah, pretty much. No one has heard uh, this. So but the, you the Germ Dizzy track, we dropped a video for that uh, a couple weeks ago. Um, Who the shot one, your video? Uh, that's my man over there, Jordan, the sloth, the goat. Okay. The Nipsey Hustle of Sacramento. That's my boy right there. What? That's my boy right we there. We need you in here, that's Nip. That's my dog. That's my dog. That's my dog. That reminds me of TikTok. Every time I, I know my friend's about to go to bed because at night she watches TikToks before she goes to sleep. My roommate and I hear that like ninety times. That's my dog. That's my dog. Because that's like a TikTok thing. So, Nipsey, rest in peace to Nipsey Hussle. I was actually just talking about Jay Stone the other day. He came in the building about six years ago, and I didn't even know who he was at that point. But he was like, "Yeah, I'm Nip. I'm Nipsey's understudy," and I was like, "What?" 
and that was way before Nipsey had you know blew up the way that mm-hmm. he did. But even to have footage of me introducing Jay Stone to like Lil Blood was historical at this point in time. So shout out Nipsey Hussle, major yep, factor. Shout out to him. Any uh, people you want to thank, uh, supporters? What's your inspiration? Family? Um, shit, just the people I got in my life. Like these people right here, always positive, fucking keep me going, fucking whether it's shows, fucking opportunities, um, just shit like that. And and let me say this again, I hate to keep blasting your age, but I know 42 year olds who can't even get a fucking day done. Like you can't even make it through 24 hours. This guy produced a whole album by the age of 20. Two. Oh, 21, 10, 21. Yeah, oh, fuck yeah. it. 21. <laughs> and it ain't off no sauce either. Like, mm-hmm. he's this, he's on the straight and narrow. Like, he's. Straight edge as fuck. Yeah, he's. Can def- I cuss? I should, yes, I you sure okay. can. Fuck yeah, I can cuss. You can say whatever you would like. <laughs> did um, <laughs> Corona yeah, yeah. slow you down or did it speed you up? I mean, uh, Neither. You kind of kept you where you were. Uh, at first, I was making like 20 beats a day, just getting crazy. And then I was like, I need to chill a little bit. Um, So then it kind of brought me back to reality. Um, But I don't really get slowed down by shit. Yeah, like, it, it just it, depends. Because this is a it's a lifestyle. It's not you know, some shit I want to do. Like I do this. This is but, what you do every yeah. day. Same same. And what you drink at Starbucks, Connor? <laughs> Fuck. What do you order when you go there? I really don't go to Starbucks like that. What are you fucking? You're you're a Dutch brother. <laughs> you're a Dutch brother. What are you a Safeway? <laughs> what are you? <laughs> okay. No, I really don't. I don't like espresso. most of them. Reason that I love is y'all is laughing because. I ask usually, and they'll say, I get the caramel frappuccino. I'm like, then you're a rapper, and you get frappuccinos, nah, you're a frapper. That's hella funny. I, I fuck no, with the, the the red tea, whatever that's called. Oh, yes. The, that shit. The refresher. Yes. That's the, really the only thing I get there. Everything else is just... Yeah, that's got hella caffeine in it, too. Yeah, Wake up cool. Yeah, yeah, cool. I'm cool off that. I'm yeah. cool off of Starbucks. Yeah. I ain't got time for nobody lying and all yeah. that. <laughs> that's Dutch yeah. Brothers, I'm my cool. guy. I don't care what it is. I, don't I had Mac J in here, and he was talking so much shit about Dutch Brothers. He's like, man, they trap be booming, though. Like, he's like, I drive by in that little blue building. There's cars around the yeah, block. Yeah, it's crazy over there. Crazy. Shout out Mac J. We got one coming yeah, soon, too. To uh, he's got 18 million views on Worldstar on his latest video. And the yeah. video before that, he shot in this room. So shout out to the true story. That's big. So when is the project coming out, or is it? Do you have a release date? Uh, so you know I mean? on Friday the sixteenth. I think that's this Friday. Yes, Friday the sixteenth. Yeah. Friday the sixteenth. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Mm-hmm. And uh, let the people know where they can be able to find it. Where uh, they be able to all download streaming it. Streaming platforms: Spotify, Apple Music, fucking Weezer, fucking I don't know what else there is. Oh, we there's, turned on the cuss button. It's shit. on. There's hell of I'm just teasing you. Cuss. Yeah, man. Any yeah. other questions for him, Mr. Tapper? Um, Being a fellow artist. Yeah, n- well, you producer. know, I'm not an artist, so, you know, I can get down, but it ain't about me right now, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, my question is to you, so yep. what's your, what is your plans after this project? You know what I'm saying? Like, are you, do you have other projects following this one? Or are you, you just going to, um, like, run with this one and see what happens out of it? You know, in, in a sense, like I, uh, I got a project with Ye Knows that's gonna drop about mm. a month or two. Um, okay. Looking forward to that. My guy. Um, but there's no like plan necessarily as far as like, oh, I got this, so I gotta drop this and that. Um, really, this is just something I, I wanted to always do. Mm-hmm. Never really had the, uh, I guess resources. Yeah, resources, uh, mindset, you know, everything. And then my homie uh, Jay Creep, we were just coming back from the Bay. He just said. Hey, what about that project you're trying to do? I was like, oh, yeah, I should do that. And then ever since then, I just fucking did it. It took about, like, two months, really, to fucking do. Um, Ye is no slouch, yeah. either. That's big. Ye yeah. knows is a very dope artist. Um, One of the one of the coolest fucking yep, facts. dudes you'll ever meet in your life. Like, very little gets under Ye's skin. Like, you have to really be annoying for it to show with Ye Knows. So, Ye Knows. You know Ye Knows. I love Ye Knows. That's independent noise. Mm-hmm. Uh, I fuck with him and his manager, um, Big Draws. They are in here a lot. So, we have played a lot of Ye. Um, so, it'd be great to get some of that song here Hell when yeah. you yeah. get that done. Um, give everybody your social sites where they can find you, Instagram names, yeah. uh, Facebook so, names. Uh, on Instagram, Connor Helm underscore one. Uh, Twitter, Connor Helm. Fucking, uh, I feel like that's really, that's really that's, it. That's, that's where it I'm is. On, okay. On social on. 
Okay, got yeah, you. Yeah. Got you. And um, what size croc would you wear? <laughs> uh, well, what size croc? I knew, but I knew she was asking, though, because she kept on saying, uh, he yeah, only saw, 21. Can you that. believe that? <laughs> He's right only that. 21. Like, she's trying to, she let the oh, world I, know. I know like, diamond in the rough. Yeah, she already let it, like, uh, he's, he's only 21. Can you believe that? And can you believe that? That's why she over here trying to fish. <laughs> no, what size crack asshole. you wear? He's uh, an asshole. I'm just well, kidding. You're not the He's asshole. only 21. Uh, uh, t- no, 22. Oh, 21? As soon as she had 21, her eyes got big. Like, oh, you're a year younger? <laughs> like, she scored. Like, oh, 21. I told you I lost one. I got to get another one back. Man, she doing. You got to relax. I know. Got to relax. I relaxed all of COVID. I don't need to relax anymore. Oh, she outside with it's this time shit. To be she outside. Trying. I am hosting Sucker Free Sesh next Saturday in San Francisco. DJ Rick Lee, the dragon in the mix, yeah. mix, 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 mix. So if you get that way and you like to smoke, you should you should roll through. It's a free event. It's going to be uh, nice and balmy, 82 degrees in the city. Uh, so you don't have to worry about d- damn near dying in the desert like uh, Kushtok. No offense, but we almost all did die. It was very hot. If it's say like 82 degrees in the city, it's going to be 64. Yeah. Bring a jacket. Yeah, bring a coat. <laughs> but it's a cold world, so I stay with a coat. Bring a jacket. So, yeah. a hoodie, um, whatever. Whatever. Anything you, you want to tell the world before you get out of here? And we're going to play your last song, Monte Carlo, when we exit. Uh, shout out to Ye News. Fucking, we made a song in like 10 minutes. Oh, Ye's on yeah. this song. Uh, yep. I have to send him this live right now. Much love, Connor. Much Hill. Connor. I wish you much success and uh, uh, good luck you. going forward, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, yes we also Appreciate have everybody. DJ, shout DJ. out to your squad, too, man. You know what I mean? Y'all want to come get behind the mic and come, y'all want to come get on the camera and get y'all yeah, shout outs yeah, on and y'all over, yeah. you know what I mean? Let y'all talk your shit. It's good by yeah, being yeah. humble, but come get your shine sometime, yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? Please, please. Uh, I can't do it alone, right now, you feel uh, me? Uh, drop Losing Focus, or we didn't drop it. We got a movie coming out. Shout out uh, my yeah. man, Big Slot, Jay Zor. Yeah, 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 you know, movies. it's Hippie Life Camp, City Sound Camp. We out here going crazy. Like I said, it's Big Maggiano, the majesty in his day. Shout out Connor Hill. Hey, Connor Helm, real quiet and humble and don't talk that much. He's a motherfucking goat, so I'll say it for him. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you tap in with this motherfucking music because uh, you need to. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, times are changing for sure. Yeah, sir, the times are changing coming soon. Shout out to Goat right here. Yep. This guy's the best producer in SAC to me, if you ask me. That's big. I go by the name of G Cruising. If you snoozing on my music, then, hey, you losing. <laughs> I, got, I, got, I, got, I got a song on the project. It's called You. Y'all go check that out. Yep. Fire, right, fire right up. And y'all go tune in with this showcase on the 17th. And that's the the point guard. What's your name back there, sir? Point guard. Oh yeah. man, you know, man. If you don't know, you probably won't know. I go by the name of Deuce Biglow. You feel me? Real hippie like shit. Real money, real shit, man. Shout out to my brother Kano, you know what I'm saying? Sure. Shout out to Mickey, shout out to the whole camp. You know what it is, man. Sure. Times are changing. Man, good luck, man. Good luck going yeah. for it, man. <laughs> good to see you guys. Much love, y'all. Let's rock that track out. Much hey, man, you got to have a team, man. So make sure you put your team, in, you know what I'm saying? Spoons and Sean Stussy My word the spoon Shoulda said it right But none of that shit really moved me When niggas buying Gucci and Louis With Louboutines I been in the hype shoes On the hype scene With hype chicks I ain't hype list <laughs> I'm the motherfucking hype bitch like that nigga on the side of the star rap on stage Ain't really saying too much, but I'm in my ways I be always on the surf, catch on the waves And if I cut off these braids, I'll take your bay on God <laughs> On God Yes Look, this the word I'm slurring Got you feeling like you in church or something what you talking about? Got the past at your wife and he flirting. Mm-hmm. Shit, it's it's disturbing. disturbing. Look, mm-hmm. oh my God. I got this shit wrapped like a turban. These my bars though. Yeah. Same nigga that's trying to head for the stars though. I, I got bars on bars. I'm talking Carlo. Cruising in Monte Carlo. Yeah. It don't get better than this. Same nigga that was rolling them splits Gon' be the same motherfucker Buying whips and kicks for all my kids Oh God I put that shit on my kids Oh God I'm eating, put on your bids, motherfucker at the park.
you feel me? You know, and it's performing live. I think it was in LA. That's, that's how I'm feeling right now. Cheetos going yes, crazy, though. Yep. You could pretty much run your own interview right. on my show. <laughs> <laughs> well, I appreciate you having me. Oh, yeah, no problem. Man. You're all good. And I'll get it to you as soon as I get yeah. everything.